And of course, what better place to start off with but Target? Y'all know I love that place. But things are going to change up a little bit because I'm going on a spending freeze from January the 18th until July 1st. So we'll see how that goes. But I have a huge Target haul. You know, these black designers and Target showing out. And you know, I got to bring it to you. I got I to gotta let y'all see what they see. And um, it is beautiful. It is wonderful. I have two huge bags. A whopping $512. But we'll talk about all that later and the quality. But I wanted to start off because I just got in and I had to wear this shirt. So I wanted to start off with this shirt because, oh God, which design is this? Um, I love the shirt. It is a hoodie and it was $30. All of the stuff is very reasonable to me. So it's $30. Of course, it got a hood and it's cropped, but everything is covered. And these rainbow jeans, y'all seen things I did a haul on these, but yeah, this is a 3X because the 4X looked huge. And y'all know I already have a problem. I buy 4X and they be way, way too big. So, yeah, a $30 crop hoodie. Comfortable. Today it was, it's no snow. It's kind of nice in Chicago, but it still was kind of chilly. And I wasn't cold. I had my coat open, my jacket open, and I was fine. So, yeah, I wanted to start off with this. Things might be a little bit different. I only just started the video off. Tomorrow, I'm going to finish it up. But, yeah, that's this hoodie. You got a pocket in the front. And, uh, yeah, I like it. Yep. I wore my little, my boots. They ain't Tim's, but they sound like Tim's. <laughs> they Tim-ish. <laughs> anyway, we're going to go and get to the next thing tomorrow. And I just want to say thank you. Everyone that has subscribed or shared my videos or found it interested enough to stop in one of these stores and purchase something. But I am at 2,000. I know that's small to a lot of people, but I reached the goal that I was trying to reach for 2022. And that's always a plus. So happy, happy, happy new year. We're going to reach some new goals this year. We're going to make a lot of money this year. We're going to live in bask in nothing but glory of good vibes, blessings, and positive people, things, places. So with that being said, y'all know me, and you know I love Target. I left out of Target with two big bags and two small bags. Went in there for one thing. I'm like, let me just see what they got so I could do a haul. And why not start off with one of my favorite places, Target. So, baby, I took a picture. I actually started this video last night, but I started. I decided to re-enter this haul. But we got about seven, eight pieces and some little knickknacks. I'm not going to do the undies until the Valentine's Day. Little thing I got going. But, yeah, we're going to get started today. We're going to try to get through it all. Um, everything in the haul is at 3 or 4X. Uh, normally, 4Xs at Target because they stuff are really cut properly for four-figure women. Um, the 4X is normally too big, depending if it has stretch. If it has stretch, it's definitely too big. If it don't have stress, it may still be too big, especially in the boob area. It's going to fit down here possibly, but then it'll be bigger in the waist, but it's going to fit my hips and butt. So my size, I'm five, eight and a half. My size is a 22, 24. If there's no stretch in it, I'm going to get a 26. Um, as you, I love satin stuff. So when I seen the satin stuff out, it's so hard for me to get satin. Because nine times out of ten, it don't have stretch. And it ain't going to fit me. It, it just ain't. It ain't stretching. It ain't coming up. It ain't fitting right. So when I seen these, I said, let me see what happened this time. So we got some pieces. I think they're beautiful. And these, <laughs> these designers in Target got their foot on my neck. Let me tell you why. Because they are exclusive to everyone from a zero 
to a 4X, which is a 2628. Listen, you can't ask for more, to be completely honest. And, and a 2628 is normally cut bigger. So if you are 30, you probably still can fit it. I'm telling you all to check out Target. Especially let's support our black um, designers and support our black owned businesses. So with that being said, I'm going to stop rambling and get right to it. Okay, y'all. So this is a 4X. This is by Ava. And it was $30. You can not. Do you hear me? You cannot beat this price. You just can't. You can't beat the price. This fabric is not like this is a 4X, so I got wrong. So hopefully, because y'all don't really do green, but I ain't really mad at this. I'm gonna be completely honest. It got the little cow neck. I did have to uh bring the adjustables up because I already I could tell up in here was gonna be too big. So I pulled it up. I'm not really mad at the fit. I'm going to be completely honest. Um, I like where it's hidden. I guess because it got elastic in the waist, if you wanted to like bring it up some or make it where it was going to be a little bit shorter, you could. And even probably put a belt belted. Uh, it didn't come with a belt. But you see how much of it was up. But you, you, could, you can. You can do it. it. Like I said, it's a light elastic in the waist and it's nice and floor this sexy to me and y'all know i don't really like green but yeah this sexy and this would be this is work and church appropriate with a blazer or a shrub or whatever i personally wouldn't be in church with my arms out like this no not that i'm embarrassed of my arms because these pillows is okay but I just, I don't know. My grandmother, sometimes when you wearing or doing, when I'm wearing certain things to church, I can just hear her saying, T, no. So, that's me personally. You wear what you want to wear. I just personally would probably throw a blazer on with it. A white or a cream would be awesome with this with some little heels. Of course, I got my toes out, my, my feet out. Well, yeah, I like that. Turn around. Everything is covered. It's not, see, I got a lot of space, so I'm praying to God that the black one in the 3X fit because I'm definitely keeping it. I almost want to keep both of them, but I still will go, I will go, depending on how the 3X fit, I will replace this one with the 3X. And this would be my little Mother's Day dress because y'all, I, I ain't, I ain't going to say Easter. I'm not sick, so. Um, yeah, with that being said, this is very, this fabric is amazing. It ain't no stretch in it. Well, it is stretching it. It ain't a lot of stretching it, but it is stretching. Listen, go get this dress. Go get it. Like I said, I'm not a green person, and this is actually the green that I don't care for. And I'm not mad at it. I think it's because it's with the white. The cow neck not all out of hand. Go on, Ava. Y'all already know. Okay, it looks like the one has some static clean, but that's probably my shapewear. Let's get on to the next. Okay, so this is the 3X, same dress. Uh, of course, you can see that it's fitting a little bit uh, snugger, but I still have space. Like, I don't feel like I'll be uncomfortable in it. And I think it's, like I said, clean like this because I think it's static clean. And I'm not spraying nothing on it. So... Yeah, I'm not mad at this uh, fit. I like both fits. I like this fit that is, I didn't steam anything either. So again, if you wanted to, this one is a little shorter too. So I probably would kind of hike it where to be right at my knees. No, no, I want my knees showing, but yeah. And I think this would be beautiful by itself. Or really pretty with a gold chain belt. Yeah, so let's see if it's hiking up in the back of that booty. No, I'm not mad at this fit. At all. So, that's this one. Of course, you know it's Ava. $30. Uh, this is definitely a keeper because I've been looking for a black satin dress forever. This week alone, because at the January the 18th, I'm going on a spinning freeze. 
Of course, I got business money to the side to do my hauls, but I ain't keeping nothing. Uh, I'm minimalizing my closets. You know, I'm trying to keep selective and buy selective good pieces opposed to buying a lot of fast fashion. Fast fashion should be very little in your closet and pieces that are of quality that you can see yourself having the longevity. Like I said, it's a longevity unless I just lose too much weight and it's too big, but I'll be at the cleaners like take this in. Anyway, but it's $30, so you won't feel as bad. It's $30, it's good quality, and it's a classic slip, satin slip dress that you can wear this with some heels in the summer. It's heavy. The summer it might be a little hot, but this is still three seasons because in the winter you can put on some heel boots, some tall boots, and a sweater shrub over it or a blazer over it and wear it. On the spring and fall, you could throw, you could kind of dress it down, throw on a denim jacket and some little slides in, slide in with it. And in the spring, you can wear some slides or a little sandal with your feet out, depending on where you're at and what the weather is. So this is something I can see three seasons that I can see being wore over and over again. Not over like you're wearing the hell out of it, but wearing it to where you're going to get the the pay out of it and you only pay $30. So listen, y'all, we jack off $30 ordering shit from Uber Eats with that might be $8 delivery charge and other charge. And when you get through your bill, $37, you be like, how? That's a whole, <laughs> that's a whole nother video and I ain't gonna rap. But anyway, this is this dress. Absolutely love it. Quality is chef kitchen and you feel sexy in it. So yeah, I might wear this to my little birthday. Well, actually my birthday then is supposed to be a little casual, but this is definitely something I went out when me and the girls have brunch. Because I can feel sexy and still be single and still do your thing, right? So, yeah. And you might want to even throw this on for Valentine's Day with red accessories, red heels, or whatever, little red. If you're going on a date. I'm single, so if I want to take myself out on a date, which I'm probably not, then this would be perfect. Okay. I love this pink on me. It's making the melanin pop. So, we have the first black designer from, the not at, at Target, but the first one I'm trying on. This is by Sammy. She's one of the, it's a lady, and one of the designers. Um, this is a sweat shirt material. Of course, this is, this is a 3X. I didn't get the 4X because the, when I took it off the hand, it looked huge. And honestly, I kind of think I could have sized down to the 2X. And I like I started back on trying to cut back on what I eat and do get a certain amount of steps in and my fat burners, period. Because I need some aid and assistance. <laughs> but but so I might I might go back and get the two X. Now the skirt, do I got this on right? Yeah. I like this little scallop, like gonna be fake split thing on the sides. Now this skirt, this outfit to me and for my work is appropriate for my job to me. I would throw this on with some socks and some gym shoes and um, call it a day. This kind of heavy, you might get through the spring with it, but you're going to be hot in the summer with this on. It's too much. But it's absolutely delightful for right now. And if it's too chilly where you at, you can throw on some tights and some booties or some tights. And your gym shoes still. But or some bare paws or Uggs. Because I wouldn't try to dress this up. I would wear it casual. I also would wear this sweatshirt with some jeans or some nice leggings. Because even though it's sweatshirt, it kind of gives you a little dressy vibe, to be honest. Love the way the sleeves are. Yeah. Nice and spacious and roomy. Like I said, the color is absolutely gorgeous for us chocolate girls. Yeah, get let us shine. So I, you listen, blind them. Step out and bam, bam, blind them with this color. Cause I put it on, like, woo. But I ain't mad at it. Cause I color my nails this color all the time in the spring and summer. And I love pink. So you see that it's not too short in the back. Cause because my um shapewear ain't even showing. So yeah, 
And even though it's cropped, it's covering everything. Let me show y'all this. See the elastic band at the bottom? Yeah. I just got it tucked under. Yeah, I think I'm going to exchange this shirt for a 2X and keep it. Not sure if I'm keeping the skirt, but I'm definitely keeping the top. I love it, and I can wear it with some jeans or some leggings and be comfortable at work. And I can still reach and all of that and nothing will be showing it out. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm probably going to get hot, but I be hot damn near every day now, so it really don't make a difference. But the top was $30. And the bottoms, the skirt was $30. Can't beat these prices. Thank you all for making this affordable, stylish, and exclusive to everyone. I'm very grateful. Very happy, very grateful because we in a time that eggs is $9. So they could have came at you like, oh yeah, 65 and 65, we already know places that do it. And it's fast fashion, they have a good quality. This is quality. Like, I'll put this on the line with Eloquii. Because this is what people like to throw out. Eloquii, um, because I brought stuff from Eloquii. And I ain't talking about Eloquii El elements from Walmart. I'm talking about Eloquii. That people are like, oh yeah, they made a little cheaper brand. Might be cheaper fabric. That ain't really true either, but whatever. But, yeah. This is top quality for $30. Another place will easily charge you about $65, $70 for it. Period. You know? But let's be thankful that they ain't try to hit us like the ad companies did. <laughs> $15 for the Walmart double eggs. 36 eggs is 15 Okay, anyway, let me get out my tantrum. Y'all feeling this color? Put a, put a pink card. Do they have pink cards? Put some pink in the comments below if this color is for us chocolate women. Put a heart. Fuck it. Put a brown heart. Yeah. So I also, <laughs> I also got this sweatshirt. This one is $25 and it's by a male designer called Black Boy B. I love the fact that they got their pictures on it. Y'all really did this. Y'all did it. $25. Uh, this is not as thick, so you probably could get to the beginning of the summer with it. And if you didn't ward enough, <laughs> listen to me. If you didn't ward enough during the winter and the spring, you actually could cut this off and crop it. Cut the collar off so it can hang off your shoulder. Because if I keep it, you might see me in the summer. I might cut the sleeves off, cut the collar off, let it be a little sloppy, and crop it to where I want it. I can wear it with some little shorts. One of the days was not as hot outside. But this is gorgeous. Look at this beautiful black woman on the front. Yes. It says, my voice, my voice, my voice. <laughs> I'm sorry for yelling at y'all, but hey, sometimes you be feeling that. Trust me, when you're not being heard, my voice, my voice, my blackness, my voice. Anyway, so yeah, love this. It come over. It don't come off. <laughs> it come down, but not over. It ain't got to be over. It is what it is. It's there. But 25, and this is... Again, Black Boy Bay did that. Y'all do y'all did this. So yeah, let's get on to the next one. Okay. Wow. So the stuff got static clean. This one horribly bad. Like it is sticking to my legs. Anyway, so let's let's get to it. So this is Sammy B. No, this is Sammy. Is it, is it a G? Anyway. Sammy, I'll show you her picture in a minute. This is, the top is $30, the bottom is $30. Um, Y'all see this little ruffle? That's real cute. But you can't see it because the shirt is long. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't. I don't know if it's just too big. I should have get this a 4X. 
So with pants, then I kind of dress pants and stuff, it kind of scared me. So I immediately grabbed a 4X, but yeah, these are way too big and I'm stepping on them. And if it wasn't no set it clean, I'd be stepping on them even more. But I told you I'm five, eight and a half. So even with some, even with some little heels on, this will kind of be dragging. If it ain't dragging while I'm still stepping on it, I won't be mad. But if it's dragging while I'm stepping on it, and I got on heels, yeah, it ain't gonna work for me. I don't know if I'm mad at the pattern. I don't think so. I don't know. Hmm, let's see something. Yeah, this pattern might just. Nah. Nah. Um. <laughs> oh, I don't know how I feel about it. First of all, pissed off about all this static clay. Let's let's start there. I don't know. Because I'm not one of them big girls that be like, it's making me look bigger. I don't give a damn. Because sometimes you don't want tight shit on. You want to be free-flowing. And I absolutely love baby doll dresses, em, uh, empire dresses that is flowy. And maxi dresses that I, listen, I ain't got to show people everything all of the time. That's just how I feel. Now, I personally think it's definitely too big. Let's start there. But with me not being a green fan... And me not being, like, I don't wear a lot of blue either. Um, I don't wear a lot of blue other than jeans. I don't even know if I own a navy blue outfit or, I do. And it's actually a very casual, like, gym shoe outfit. And I still don't wear it a lot. And it's dark, dark navy, damn, to look black. But, like, I got a royal blue crop top. I don't buy a lot of blue. I don't. Uh, I'm more of a gray, white, black, pinks, yellows. I like bright, bright colors or black and gray chocolate. But like I said, it's it's a weird fabric too. So y'all see that it's the pleated material. So this is a 4X. This will well fit somebody that is a 30, 32 possibly. Uh, again, I like the little ruffle waist. It's just not for me. And I won't, this not a shirt. Well, no, wait a minute. Yeah. This not, because I'm not somebody that got to prop everything either. This just, this for more of a hobo -y, somebody that's really into hobo and stuff like that. Not ugly. The fabric is weird. I will say that because even though it's this, fabric, the uh, style is also still like a crepey. Yeah, that's what it feel like, crepey. And it's very, very long on me. And I'm not short. So if you five six, five seven, that's not for you either. It's way too long. Unless you just love it enough to get it altered. But yeah, this is this. 30 and 30. Sammy, you kept that price point where it should be. Thank you. Okay, y'all. Uh, again, Sammy B come through. She come through. So, again, I got a 4X. I don't know if I want to... Yeah, they kind of... No, this is the thing. They they are too long, but to me, this is worth being altered. And I will have them taken in a little bit in the waist. But I think I want to keep them flowy at the bottom. I am stepping on them. So, if I take them to get altered, they have pockets... They feel good. Ain't no stretch in this. None. Ain't no stretch. So let's be clear of that. Yeah, ain't no stretch. It's less than the dresses. But it's okay because they go up to a 4X. I personally think if I go and get a 3X, the fit might... That's a lot of little fabric I am squeezing up on both sides. So maybe it'll be a little bit. I don't know. We're going to see. So I might have to. I hate trying stuff on in the store. 
but I may have to, but let's get to the specs. The top is Sammy B, and it's $20. This is absolutely beautiful. It's adjustable. I personally will want this to show, so I will want this tied to the back, and plus it'll cover more of my little fat, fat out. Uh, and, uh, see what I'm saying? I would take this to the back, but ain't nobody here with me today, so I couldn't do it. So that it'll cover my little fat roll a little bit more. But I like this. I'm sure if I'm keeping it, but I do like it. I do. I might have to start stoke later on and see if it's, but it's $20. Come on, Clarence. They ain't even that, uh, I just, I want to mentally sit down and say, are you going to wear this? Now, as of December, for the most part, everything I've been trying to do is be intentional on what I buy so that I can know if I'm going to wear it. I don't know, I got stuff sitting in my closet, which I got, I already, uh, mer uh, max minimize one closet. I got to do the beauty room. In these next two weeks, and a lot of stuff still had tags, shoes, clothes, not no purses, but it is purses that I brought that I didn't buy, and I got two more purses to show you all. But anyway, I'm trying. That's that's the purpose of the freeze, cause I want to put all my money into rebranding my business. But these are very comfortable. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep the four X, and I think I'm just gonna take them somewhere. If I don't try to do it, take them up in the sides. Oh, anyway, let me get to it. These were 30. Then I brought this shirt and I got this in a 4X. So I I'm already looking at it like, girl, you dumb. Is you dumb? <laughs> and this fabric is amazing. Try not to get no. Eyebrows. Ooh, this kind of long. Girl, I'll be in here with some fishnets. I'm trying to wear this as a. Is this a cover in my booty? <laughs> whoa, 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 y'all. Whoa. Whoa. Can this be a dress? Anyway, so they got ties on the sleeves. I'm so glad my cat ain't in here. Cause he'll be like hanging something's hanging you putting on your belt he'll be looking like I'm going to get that belt <laughs> he'll be saying it like that he'll be saying none of your cat anyway but y'all see how the arms can tie up because I wouldn't be out here with just hanging like that that's dumb but I have an, I had another shirt from fashion over that did this and it's cute just a little extra detail but now, I want to know, girl, y'all, girl, men, y'all know I want to see if I can get away with this as a dress. Oh, this got stretch in it. That's weird. Anyway, I, I wouldn't wear it to work, of course, but I wouldn't wear this to work anyway to be cooking and get it fucked up. But, y'all, I think I'll put this on with some little tall boots for a brunch. And wear this to a brunch as a dress. How far? I can't see because, y'all, my little paws thing is. It's at the top of my knees. I think it's respectful. And sometimes you don't want to be respectful. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm putting this off as a dress. I'm definitely keeping it. And I think as the weight come off, because you see, I, plus I'm bloated, just ate a bagel. Anyway, I think as the weight come off, it'll get even looser, which will make it a little bit longer. This booty ain't going nowhere no time soon, and I'm okay with that. Because I don't want no flat booty. And even though the button go to there, even if you wanted to add another button to close it, but I wouldn't because you'll have more you know, room to move, it's still not way up. Beautiful quality, and y'all, it's stretch. Now, I'm a 22, 24, and you see how it's fitting me. If you in between the 24 and the 26, you can still get away with it. But I can't say that this 4X as a dress, 
will work on somebody that's at 26, 28. But if you're not trying to wear like a dress, then it'll work for you as a shirt without, you know, this happening. See how that, you don't want that. Looking like a sausage that, with some shit on too little. But this is gorgeous. I love it. So $30. The pants were 30 The Boussier, look, he's huh? The Boussier was uh, 20 So if you wanted to keep all of it, you could go on Nipsey. So he was sent this from his bed, y'all. Nipsey gone. But yeah, let's get to the last outfit. Okay, y'all. This is the last little clothing piece. We got through it. My hips hurt, but we did it. <laughs> no devil, you ain't stop it. So, and I think I'm going to keep going and try to get these other two hauls out the way because I got a busy weekend and week ahead of me. I got a 10-hour class Saturday and Sunday. But for the best, stay tuned. So, this is by Ava. It's a lounge waist, lounge set to me. I don't know if people want this outside or not. Original price was $25 a piece. I got it on clearance for $12.50 each. And this is a 3X. And like I said, it's a lounge uh, set for me. It's kind of half on the neck. But for me around the house, this is lounge wear. Now, this is loungewear to the fact that if you had to get up and run out to the store or run and pick somebody up, you can. I'm not saying you can't wear it outside, so let me get up close. But it's not, it's ribbed, but it's not a thick rib, and it's not a rib that's going to hold you. And I normally be around the house commando, so if I'm wearing this outside to go somewhere or possibly I may have to pop out, I'm going to have to put on some panties. Cause this ain't gonna this ain't gonna hold you at <laughs> all. But yeah, who wanna be in the house with panties on if they ain't got hair on them? I don't. But yeah. Might be me. But yeah, so I think this is something that if you need it to run out, you can run out. This is something I'm definitely gonna keep because I like cozy lounge wear and I finished I'm gonna be doing work on my business. This is something I could throw on and still be presentable. If I needed to do a Zoom meeting, I could still do a Zoom meeting. I'm going to be comfortable in it while I'm creating. And, yeah, I want a couple of more loungewear for home that I'm going to be cozy and comfortable but presentable in case, like I said, I have to jump on a Zoom meeting or have to run out, get some pick up because you want to be comfortable. But, yeah. This is this outfit. It ain't no pockets. That's the disadvantage, but it's a loungewear set. So I guess they like. But I probably wouldn't have paid. Did I? No. I like pockets, especially if stuff, if I'm around the house, I'm doing stuff, I want to put something in my pocket and be able to go. But it's very comfortable, very stretchy. This is a 3X. So if you were 26, 28, you still could fit it. I could have sized uh, down and been okay, but the 3X is comfortable as I start on my way journey. So with that being said, it's $12. Probably in two more weeks, it's gonna be six. I'm saying they may not have as many sizes. So we're gonna get it. If I see this again in another color before the 18th, I'm gonna get it. Because if push come to shove, I'll cut this neck off. And I will keep the top at this length. Cause it's at a, it's for the house, it, you know, cozy mean cozy. But yeah, that's it for the clothing. I got a couple of more little things. We ain't gonna get too much into the underwear because I have a Valentine's Day haul for you all that I want to put together. So I'll give you a sneak peek of some of the undies, but that's about it. Okay, y'all. So I still got on what I got on. Do I need to lower you all some? Hmm, let's see. Oh, yeah, that's better. Okay, so, as much as I be trying to say I ain't buying no shoes, I don't need no shoes, I don't, but, baby, when you go on Target and you see some platform, like, these is for me. 
They, they, they made them for me. I got a size 10. Um, they were $34, and they are by New Day. I haven't tried them on, but this strap, look. I don't have real big, I don't have cankles. And it's on the last, is it on the last one? No, it's, it's on the middle one. So it has other things, plus it has the elastic. Can y'all see that? Is it, I don't know that's not just me that can't see, but this is elastic. So it has a stretch elastic. Um, again, I don't have wide feet or wide ankles. And <clears throat> a lot of stuff that can work for me may not work for another plus size woman because your feet might or your ankles might be a little bit chunkier. I just happen to have small wrists and small, my arms ain't small though. How about that? <laughs> small wrists and small ankles. Um, and my feet not wide. So normally wide foot stuff don't work for me because it ends up being too big. So because of the platform, I can wear this tall heel. So even back in the day when I was able to wear four, four or five inch heels, I always, I could wear one that didn't have platforms, but I always went for more of a, something that had a platform on it. And I hate it when they stop uh, wearing them. And that's some of the stuff I got to let go in my closet is ones that don't have the platform. Um, this is a beautiful quality shoe. Uh, it's well made. It's, it's heavy, but not heavy to the fact that you feel like you're going to be doing a workout while you're walking. While you're walking. I love the square toe. I think that is way more sexier and sleek than round toe shoes, uh, sandals and round toe. Uh, pointy shoes, mm, I'm kind of iffy about, but I love this shoe. Love it. I'm definitely keeping them. No ifs, ands, and buts about it. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. So I'm keeping this shoe. It was $34. Dollars. Dollars. And uh, I think well worth it. No ifs, ands, and buts about that. And I'll show y'all the little other little stuff that I brought. That so you y'all. I love me some Bath and Body Works. I do. I do. But I oh it smells good. Oh, I'm about to go put this light this up in my beauty room. Why I clean my uh beauty room up because I need some motivation. And smell good gonna motivate me to do it. I'm gonna run downstairs, put my other stuff in the dryer, and then come upstairs and start on my because it's 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 a couple of days for this to happen, and I'm free, so um, being able to put it back out on it. So yeah, so this particular hey Cody, this is pineapple sage sugar cane this smell and so let me if you somebody that like you you probably wouldn't like i love sweet scents so normally the candles that i buy from beth and body works be like strawberry pound cake snickerdoodles christmas cookies something sweet smelling i like to smell edible and i like for my house to smell like something that's baking or cooking or something sweet is in it that's just me some people like other stuff God bless you. Um, y'all know I can't read this, so I'm letting y'all. I don't even see the name of the company though. Oh, there's there's hope. Yeah, normally people have it on the top. Can y'all see that? But so the issue is. People will sell you a candle and it had this beautiful scent when you smelling it like this. Now, when you burn it, you don't smell none. That'd be absolutely pissing me off. Last month, I brought a candle from Target. I burned it. It's the, I think it's the same brand. I burned it and the scent was lit up my room. I brought a uh, something eggnog and it was good. So this candle was 15 we already know that Bath and Body Works candles are 25 and I don't have no issue 
buying it. I needed some more Dove, so I got me some Dove. And, of course, soap has gone up. So, this pack, this 8-pack was $12. $11.99, $12. Where it used to be, if I'm not mistaken, $8.99. But, of course, we know inflation, so it's gone up. It is what it is. I brought me some white matte spray paint because I'm about to spray paint this cabinet. But now that I realize that I'm not going to really step outside and spray paint it outside the door because it's kind of wet outside and snow, then we expect the snow. I'm going to return this and get some chalkboard paint where I can sand the cabinet down and just wipe it down and go ahead and paint it. Plus, it's going to be a little bit better for me because I'm doing it in the base. I could just take it straight to the basement where my stuff is going to be set up and do it there. So, yeah, this is I'm returning this because of that, nothing else. And the way I spray paint, I'm liable to just keep it because something going to get sprayed in the next 90 days. And so... Mind your business. I brought some Reese Cups because that's why you should go shopping hungry. So I hadn't eaten all day. Did I? No, that day I hadn't eaten all day because I had cooked beef at work. And I think I had a bagel in the morning at like 11 and some coffee. And it was well like 7. So I was like, oh, I'm kind of hungry. And I, I got an hour ride home. And I was like... Man, this gonna, I'm going to be starving. You know, so I said, let me get a Reese's Cup instead of a sandwich. Come and say it. <laughs> anyway, so I had got this, and I'm going to keep it, and I'm probably about to eat one. Mind your business. That's all I'm going to say. So I'm going to keep my candle. Return the spray paint. So, excuse me, Tony. Yeah. Hey. What's up? What? What? You're not going out. You just came in. When I go back downstairs, I'll let you out. Yo, go on, Cody. Because you're not finna have me running up and down the stairs like you are. Excuse me. Excuse me. So, I brought some undies. I, I love panties and bras. I, I, I don't know, if, is it just me? Am I the only one that loves panties and bras? But Target has some sexy little panties and bras, but they are, you're aggressive as hell, Nipsey. They are hard to combat, so I like these because it got a little sexiness. Get the hell away from my Reese's Cup. Okay, sorry. So I like it because it got the little sexiness in the back at the crack. And that, and then I love, I love sheer panties. Sheer panties, mm, lace okay, but they got the little sheer lace. Actually, these was on clearance for $3.49. If I ever, 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 ever find some panties for under $5 for all this ass, I'm buying it. Period. And I got a bra this color, so I got panties and bra that mess, so now... I have another pair of panties to match it. I'm gonna go and show you all the rest of them. Oh no, I'm not showing y'all what I'm what I'm going to actually wear for the Valentine's thing because then yeah, y'all ain't gonna wanna see. Is that the only one I brought that was? Oh yeah, I didn't want to go crazy on the the panties because of course I got a subscription to X Fenty and I forgot to cancel it but i plan on getting around to wear anyway but you know sometimes they panties and stuff be calling me so these were on clearance for 4.39 and at first i was gonna buy these for the valentine's day haul but then i said a thong on youtube is way too much so i said i yeah mm -mm. But y'all see what's in it. See them little hearts? That's so cute. And of course, they stretchy. Now, I prefer a higher waist. A higher waist on. 
phone, and I don't think this is a high waist. No, but I did get both panties in a 4X, which is a 2830, because even though a, a 3X panty and a 3X panty and thong fit, I actually like to be able to pull them up like high waisted. And when I buy a 4X, I'm able to pull them all the way up high waisted. And these, I do got a red bra, so I might sneak this in with a robe or something sheer. I ain't figured it out, but that's next week anyway. But yeah. Sexy. So yeah, that's these panties. The other two is really for the um Valentine's Day little thing I'm planning on doing. And I know y'all gonna be happy. And I'm definitely gonna do it before Valentine's Day so you all know where I got everything from. And you can run and go get it so that you will be good. But with that being this cat would decide that he gonna use the bathroom when I'm doing the video. So if y'all hear that, I am truly sorry. And I apologize. He ignorant. Like his sister. Anyway, well, y'all, that's the end of the Target haul. What did y'all think? I'm telling you, listen. I used to work at Target when I did hair overnight doing seasonal. And just for the fun, I think at the time I did, I'm like, I want to see if I can work a regular job. Because I had been doing hair at that time, probably about six years, just straight hair. Of course, it was very profitable, and I really didn't need a second job. But I'm such a hustler. I always had some type of hustler, hustle going on on the side of me doing hair anyway, and it normally had to do with sales. So I wanted to get some retail experience, um, but I ended up taking it overnight. And listen... Between my nieces and nephews, my daughter, and my god baby, my whole check went right back to Target. To be honest, buying them clothes and 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 stuff. So, yeah, <laughs> it was fun. But I absolutely love working for Target. And I would again if I could. So, thank you all for dropping in this haul. I hope that you like it. I hope you've seen something you like. And I'm telling you, run and get it. Because, like I said, both dresses, both dresses were absolutely beautiful by Ava. Birth, and actually, like I said, I like the fit of both. But I know what I'm doing as far as cutting back or whatever. The wig going to fall off, then that 4X is going to be extremely big. But I am really considering... Stop playing with me. I am really considering getting the green ones in a, in a 3x and keeping it because even i don't like green i kind of like that so being on the hunt for a black blazer is still is is that's been an ongoing thing um i'm just so shocked i haven't found it yet in the price i want to pay i want to pay almost 200 dollars for nipsey stop trying to start fights i'm sorry y'all my when I started the video, it was nice and quiet. I think in my head, they heard me say, oh, it's so quiet and it's perfect. But with that being said, thank you. And thanks for coming. Please leave some comments. Please like, subscribe, and share. Leave a comment in the bottom. Tell me what y'all think. And I'm still growing my channel. So I got another goal. I would like to be by, I'm, I'm doubling it. I'm claiming it. I'm doubling it. I would like to be at 4,000. By the time we're going into 2024. Anyway, I thought somebody was coming through the front door. I'm like, hold up. But, yeah. So, thank you. And please like and subscribe and share and leave a comment. And if that pink was looking good on the metal line, leave a heart. Chocolate or pink. I like both. So until we talk again, here go a whole bunch of chocolate kisses for you. Bye-bye.